What's up fam? It's iCamron here. I have not done one of these for a while, so bear with me. Um, but you know, I like to share with you guys the coolest tricks, tips, whatever it may be. This time it's with Final Cut Pro X if you're on the Mac OS Big Sur. Okay, so if you want to have your logo or like just any picture that you, you know, PIP or PIP is what people call it, picture in picture. So like, for example, right here, I'm trying to put this logo, you know, in there, but I want it to fade in and not just pop in like it normally does. And so I'm gonna make it easy for you guys. It's gonna be a quick video. Um, bear with me here. Let me grab a sip of my beer. So what you wanna do is, I had no idea this was even here because I'm so new to Final Cut, but right click it, hit show video animation. Okay, then you got all this stuff over there. I don't really know what all that does, but com compositing, like put that little arrow down. And I already did this, I already made it fade, but yours will have like a straight line that goes across. So just hold the Alt or the Option key and then uh, start clicking basically each little point. Uh, you can click as many points as you want uh, to make it like perfect. What I did, I started from like, you know, nothing, went up a little bit, little bit, got all the way, um, and then I just dropped. So this is what it looks like when it's all said and done. Just fades in and out, and then it fades away. And so if this is annoying to you, um, the big, uh, tall, like, you know, expansion, hit hide video animation once you did that and it's gone away, but it still saves. So that is the quickest way to do it. You know, guys, I'm always here to show you the greatest tips and tricks um, that anybody could do. Uh, like and subscribe. Make sure to comment down below if you like this video. I'll catch you next time. Later, fam. Love me, love me.